Hey everybody, Brin here, and as you can see in my wins and losses, I've been a bit busy. I should keep here. Now then, I reworked my deck, and with a few cards I've earned, like I got a couple of machine factories. I was actually able to get a Skull Knight, surprisingly. I don't know if they were... Oh yeah, I got it from Reincarnation. There's no code for it. I wish. Yeah, that's a real good card. Yeah. Good old Feral Dragon, who's actually getting pretty high up in the ranks. My robotic knights. Yes, knights. Spider flames. I was actually able to reincarnate a card and I was able to get Grigal. And yeah, this is my deck. We're going for the Necromancer. I'm hoping I can take him down. I'm also hoping I can get that pumpkin. Because I think it's possible I can get it because it's his deck leader. And I think deck leaders are... Well... I'm pretty sure the uh, these kind of windmills were used in uh, these times. Oh my god. A freaking javelin gun. I mean, he has a sword, but he doesn't even use it. Oh, 
goes. And that was a mistake. Well, let's see how the, uh... I'm actually kind of curious how Wooden Rain's an armored zombie attack. Ugh. That is ugly. So weird. <laughs> Look how a little kid swings a sword. At least I'm not in range. Mm. The robotic knight can't take it. It's too powerful. zombies in my deck. I got really weak ones. Come on. Show me a bit of love, game. Mm. No, that's not gonna work. Do this, but I gotta. Go, go, your defense mode. Outside of his deck. Oh, robotic knight. Let's see. Yeah, you should be able to wipe him out. Robotic knight, front and center. That's a pumpkin. Let's take a look and see what's in that graveyard. I don't trust it. Surprise!
ground attacker. What the hell is that? Spellcaster. Go figure. <laughs> oh, you are Oh my god. That is so cool. Fucking A. Pumpkin. Yeah, this thing is OP as balls. You might think, well, what's so special about it? Well, here's the thing. Let me just have a nice look at that ability. While it's in defense mode, all zombie monsters are increased by 100 points at the start of each turn. Every zombie. That includes itself. You put a couple on the field, you win. Ugh, I can't even shield and sword it. Pull out. Yeah, it's not gonna help much. 
on each barrel dragon. Ah, oh, shit. It's gonna grow now. I can make my own pumpkin. But of course I couldn't. And this is how I die. There is hope. Oh, 
You just fucked up. Rail Dragon? Finish it. Fire! You know what? Let's watch this. This I need this. Rev it up. And okay. I guess Russian Roulette ain't your game. actually a low cost for a decent attack. Yeah, just hand it over. Oh god, look at that face. Ugh. Yeah, look at that. A DC 14 for a 1350. That is really good. I can just get rid of this bone mouse. Just set the clowns up here. Now, Shadow Ghoul, on the other hand, can move into Labyrinth terrain and transform into Wall Shadow. I think that might come in handy later. Yes. I'm gonna have to look that up, see what that does. Like on the wiki. See what, like, Wall Shadow does in the context of this game. Like, yeah, look at that. Clown Zombie's only 14. Uh, let's compare to, say, like, uh... Yeah, look, Hologram. 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 Yeah, how about, like, Wicked Dragon with Eris Head? Like, something that is weaker actually costs more. Whereas Clown Zombie, on the other hand, is... I think, like, Clown, Armor, and Dragon Zombie have a low cost because the game takes into account, like, their defense and their level. And since it's a low level with no defense, low cost. So you can imagine how kind of you can take advantage of this. Which I'm gonna be doing. Hey, Zombie Boy! <laughs> I'm about to go Bandit Keef on your ass. Or if you want, I'm about to go Bakora on your ass. Ooh, this is gonna be satisfying. Before we do this, I'm gonna save, and we'll be back next time. See ya soon. <laughs>